All right, so I got some new things from Wooden Wick. So, a little mini update on like what's been going on with my business is um, I just had a lot on my plate, okay? I've had a lot on my plate and I've been doing a lot of planning but not a lot of executing and so it's been kind of hard for me in some ways so I'm trying to figure out what to say um so to start I hate my jars <laughs> so I or maybe I don't hate them um, my office is a little messy and junky. But, so, I don't hate them, but um, I definitely want a different vibe. And I don't really know what specific vibe I want, but I know it's not matte black jars anymore. And, you know, it's a very small part of decor, but candles are a part of your home's decor, you know? Like, so your packaging, you know, some people don't care, but some people do care, and I'm one of those people that do care. And I mean, my home, I mean, I haven't showed you guys my home, but a lot of the decor here is black, and I love black. Like, black is one of my favorite colors, but, and I mean, you guys have seen, some of y'all have seen my journey from when I first started. Of course, I just moved into this house, different decor, different stuff. So I didn't choose my jars because of my decor. That doesn't make any sense. But I'm realizing that I have like a fixation on black. So, um, and as I'm decorating my home and I'm using my candles in my home, and I'm really using them as a function. I wish I had more options, you know, selfishly. I'm like, mm, I wish I had something that I don't offer. Um, and so I got a package from Wooden Wick, as you can see. So we're gonna open this box because I have some things that I wanna show y'all. And honestly, I got some things that I wanna see, so. In this rebrand, I'm trying to find some things. And I don't know if I'm gonna go with Wooden Wick or whatever, but definitely wanted to unbox this with you guys. wooden wick package and this is so I ordered these for some samples because I am switching up my packaging and I wanted to get an idea of what to get like just an idea of like what some of these jars look like in real life um they are pretty accurate to the wooden wick website um but i'll show you guys what i got um if you haven't ever been on wooden wick website they have all kinds of jars they have tins so i'm curious about the tins and honestly these are really cute kind of they're damaged but mm -hmm. so this is one of the tins that i got this is a is this the I think this is the peach one yes this is the peach glam tin it looks really pink it looks like blush pink to me this isn't very peachy but let me move closer but it's super cute really love it um this is really cute oh my gosh okay obsessed 
the, I didn't expect to like this. I just bought it because I was like, let me just, let me just open my mind. Let me see what's out there and we'll make a decision based on everything. I am missing one though. I'm definitely missing one. Or maybe I didn't buy it. Maybe I didn't buy it, but they have an olive green one that I really wanted anyways, but maybe I just didn't get it. But here is the peach glam tint. It looks like blush pink in case you were wondering. This is what it looks like on the inside, blush pink as well. This is really cute. I feel like these tints are very different from the other ones I've ordered from them. I don't know how, but maybe like they feel a little bit more sturdy. I don't know. But bl blush, no, 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 peach, peach. Since we're in pink, you know, I ordered the Flamingo. The Flamingo Glam Tin. This is the color, or this is the Flamingo color. Um, inside, Flamingo as well. And then this is the lid. This is the Navy Glam Tin. Same situation. Here's the color. This is the Cloud Glam, glam Tint, I'm assuming. This is cute too. These are giving Easter colors. Super cute. I smelled it because it has like a, one side has like a texture on it. Oh, like, did, they, they, did they spray paint these? That's what it smells like. It smells like paint. Anyways. Boom. This is... I don't know what this is. Oh, I think this is stone wash. It's like a gray. Stone wash color. I ain't mad at these either. I am not mad at these. These were definitely spray painted. You can tell. Some of them have texture. Oh. What the fuck is that? Okay. I don't know what that is, but it looks like sand. Um, but yes, but I'm not mad at this job. Okay. Okay. The ones that I was not, the ones that I ordered just on a whim are the ones that I'm loving the most. The ones that I ordered because I, I just wanted them, because I thought I liked them. I mean, I don't dislike them, but these other colors are hitting a little different. And then this last 10 I got, I think, Actually, I don't know. I think this might be the blush glam tint, tint. Because it's definitely not peach. This is like a lavender color, which is super cute. Super, super cute. Like, super cute. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. I'm fucking with these colors. I'm a fan of the glam tins. Like, I like these tins, okay? Okay, my brain is like on overload right now. So this next thing that I ordered is something that I don't remember ordering. So, why would I order just one of these? What is this? Let me get my paper. I ordered one of these. Why would I do that? I'm, I swear I must not be paying attention when I order things sometimes. Because I'm like, this doesn't even make sense. Why would I order this? But this is what I ordered. It is a refillable insert. Wooden wick, if you don't know or haven't been to their website in a while. They do have these re refillable um, 
glass containers that you can put inside of real stone wear. So super cute, super cute. I just love these. And honestly, you could just use these as candle jars, which I love and which I may do because the shape is really cute. It's like, it's like a cylinder, like a little cylinder, you know? Super cute, super, super, super cute. So bought that. And now the last four items. are a part of their aura collection or the next three items are a part of their aura collection which is the style jar that i use for my jars right now i like the shape of them but because I just went on a rant about how I don't want black anymore. But the reason why I'm a little hesitant to use black is because I realized that when I light candles, I like to see the light reflect off of things, you know? And I like to see the candle flicker. I like to see the candle like illuminate the walls. Like I like that about the candles. And when you have a matte black jar, once it gets to a certain point, you don't see no candle. It's just for fragrance at that point. But I realized I like candles because of the fragrance as well. Like I like a, a good smell at home, but mostly I really like the vibe that it provides. I like lighting, I like mood, I like that, you know? And with the matte black candles, you can't tell that there's a candle in there, you know? It's just for function at that point. But I'm like, candles are a part of your decor. So this is a black jar. But it is transparent, okay? It is a transparent black jar and like, it's thick, shit thick. And I really am not mad at this, okay? I am not mad at this. I am not mad. It is great quality, sturdy, and just overall, like, I like the shape. And this is, I believe, 14 ounces. 12 ounces 12 ounce jar so that is what this aura jar is looking like and I have the matte version of this um, already but I'm not mad at this I'm just I'm just my mind is working I'm like okay how do I make this work how do I make this work It's transparent, which I like. So I got another one of these jars. I don't know which one is which, but I ordered two of one. Okay, got the right one. They have a frosted glass version of this jar that I'm not mad at either. And I think I got two of these because one is just going to be for, just for me to have on deck, if I, you know, just for samples, just in case I'm like, what jar? If I ever wouldn't change my jars again. So I got one to make a candle in and then also, oh, um, okay, I see what they did there. They also improved their glasses. That's what I'm noticing. Yes, they improved their glasses. So before, if you can see at the bottom up here, there's like an indentation. That indentation used to be on the inside of their actual jars, but now it looks like it's like double line. So yes, there's indentation at the bottom, but inside the jar, it's no longer, it's just a flat surface. So kudos to them. Yes, okay. I'm not mad at the frosted. I'm not mad at the frosted. Am I mad at the frosted? I'm not mad at the frosted, okay? So that's that. Okay, so this last jar is another one of the frosted jars, so I'm not gonna open it. But I have one. Oh. Mm, mm, mm. Woo! Won't he do it? Won't he do it? All right, I'm hyped already. So, so 
I have one more tin to show you guys. But I ordered this on a whim. I've never seen these before, but I just went ahead and ordered a pack of six, I think. Or 12. I ordered a pack of 12 and I ain't seen them in my life. But I just knew. I knew they were the ones when I saw them because I'm simple like that. But I just got to peek, y'all. I don't know if y'all ready. Y'all might be ready. I'm a little simple. So this might not get y'all as hype as it got me, but okay. I got some matte white glam tins, y'all. Oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Yes. Just yes. Okay. Here's what they're looking like. And it's white. It's white. It is white. I'm fucking with these, y'all. Whoo. Whoo. I think I just. I did something with this. I did something with this. I did something with this. Okay. So the all white. They definitely spray paint these, though. No shade. I'm not mad at it. It's not bad quality. You know, you can just tell. Um, ooh, because they're mad, I could see them getting dirty easily. But, you know, if it's just for home decor and decorations. I love these jars. I'm definitely using these jars. But here's the jar. They are around, they are a pretty little, you know, penny. But I will say anytime I've ever ordered from Wood & Wick, they have definitely been high quality. And if I've ever had any issues with any of the products they sent me, they sent me new products. So, can speak on that. Um, and it doesn't have the prices on here, but I'm pretty sure the Glam Tins, I pay $5 each. $5 is some change each for these. Um, and then when you order in bulk, you get discounts. If you're interested, if you like what you see, I will link them down below, but y'all, speaking to my soul it is speaking to my soul so oh my gosh i don't think y'all get it like i look at everything like art like everything is like art to me i look at every detail every crevice every curve everything and i'm just like man it's so simple but this really makes me happy like this really makes me happy design makes me happy decor makes me happy and like ooh, baby this is a winner. I don't know why I knew I would know, but I knew. And I did that. Woo! These other ones don't even really matter to me anymore. Hands down. Like, honestly, honestly, it is a wrap. A wrap. But I'm gonna be quiet. Um, everything in this, um, box will be linked down below. This was not a sponsored video. Just in case y'all was wondering, I know I got a real hype, but I've been looking for jars, looking for things. And yeah, I really like, I don't know what I was expecting, but I do. And I'm not mad at these black jars. I'm not mad at them. You told me I could trust you, you don't die I could really